Hey, this is Wild West Show showing you how to use Source S to SDK. First of all, go to Steam. I'll show you here in a second. First, you're gonna need that code. Once you have that, go to right click on the Steam icon down there on your desktop. And go to the Tools tab. And if you don't have a Source S2 SDK, some people say you have to buy it. I don't know about that, but download it, launch it, and if it doesn't work, like if it just says that, if it just does this, like it's gonna do CSS or whatever, it just. If it doesn't pop up, go to go all the way back to community tools source s2 s t s d k. I don't know why that gets me. Right click properties. Set launch options. And you put the code in there, and it'll work. Now, I'm just gotta wait for this. Now, when it pops up, It'll look like this. Go to Counter Strike Source, whichever one you want to do. I like Counter Strike Source the most, so I'm gonna go to that. Go to Hammer Editor. By the way, this is part one of many more, I guess. <laughs> and if you're wondering how I got these skins back here, <clears throat> I went to FPS Banana been under counter strike source skins well I'm not gonna walk you through that right now but I already have a tutorial out there a tutorial <laughs> one of these how to apply to your CSS skins and just watch that there's also one for a uh, halo trial editor wood mod not a mod creator, but showing you how to apply mods. Now it looks like this. Go to file new. Now you have this. Go to the fist icon down. This is your 3D 3D view. What it's gonna look like? Top view, side view, side view. Go over here. I like to, I don't know. Now, do that. Hit enter on your keyboard. Now you got that. And now if you want to look at it in your 3D, just click on the camera icon, click over there. And if it looks cool, 
if you're inside the box and it will if it looks like that just scroll out and if it still looks like that you're gonna want to go to view 3d shaded and texture polygons now I want to make some walls click that go over here How do I get two cameras? Let's see if I can work on this camera or not. Oh. Two cameras. I didn't don't know how I got two cameras. See if I do it on this. Guess you can. Oh man, this is a bad tutorial. Very bad. I'm gonna go ahead and make a new one. Because that was horrible. Not a new video, but just a new one of those. Go the fifth icon down, make your square or whatever you want to do, rectangle. Click enter camera, click on that. Then use your WASD or keyboard arrow keys to move around like that, to look, anyways, and WASD to move. Now, we're going to want to look at some people, apparently, three, four, to scale the thing, compare it, now, now we got some characters right there, go over here, and I usually just go out, but then go over here to your side view one and crank it up as high as you want it. Then hit to enter. Now you've got that as a back wall. Now I want a different texture for there, that. So I'm going to go over here. And you can scroll on these and zoom in and out, but then you go over here to your side, hit enter. I know this looks kind of gay, but I'm just showing you the basics. Now you guys see why it's so hard. <laughs> Now I'm looking for a different one. Anything. And I think the same thing I had. Now over here. You do most of the stuff on this uh top view, but you just size it up on this. But it's Pretty cool. Guess you could use it as a map on CSS if you wanted. Anyways, that's part one. I'll have a different thing when I do part two. It'll be a good looking map, I guess. I don't know. Depends how much patience I get. But there is how you do it basically there'll be more on it later but you can put as many I just use these for fun when you get bored 
We're frustrated. Put him in the air if you want. And that is the tree troll of the day, of the week, I guess. And I'll try and have one for you guys, maybe next, next two hours if I try. It's two o'clock, so. And the date is March 17, 2008. That's, there we go. You can save it if you want, but I'm not. I'm not, because I'm going to make a better one. So, 